Planting a plant into the ground seems like a bit of an ominous task, but it's actually really simple. So probably the main thing you need to look is making sure that you're picking the correct plant for the area that you're planting in. So out we're here where we are today in the lovely Sanford Valley, we're in a bit of a eucalypt forest. So we've got a few different plants that we can choose from. And I've ended up selecting this Psychotria, which is a small shrub that grows in our eucalypt forest in this area. So when you're digging your hole for your plant, there's a few things you want to keep in mind. The basic rule of thumb is you want to dig a hole that is slightly bigger than your pot and roughly twice as wide. So you can see here, our depth is a little bit deeper than our pot and it's quite a bit wider, but that's, that's totally fine. So once we've got this in here, we've dug our hole, we've gotten it ready to go. It's simply gently remove our plant from the, from the pot by giving it a small tap on the top and guiding it out of its pot. And then the first thing we want to do is add a little bit of compost to the bottom of the hole. Unfortunately out here, our soil's a bit dry and rocky. So we're just trying to give that plant a little bit of an extra boost in nutrients to keep it going. We then we just want to center our plant in the middle and backfill with any of the soil that we've gotten around the place. So be careful to try to not backfill with mulch or other bio or organic material as this can break down and create air gaps in the soil that can cause problems in the future. If your hole is quite rocky and you don't have enough for dirt to backfill, don't be afraid to just dig another hole somewhere else and get dirt from that hole to help fill in your hole with the plant. So you can see here, I've got a little bit of a depression from the plant so that once we water this, it'll go in nicely. Once we've gotten this here, what we wanna do is put a little bit of mulch around it. So we've got just some mulch here. And so we just wanna place a nice thick layer of mulch around our plant. You wanna aim for about a 10 centimeter thick layer around our plant. There we go. And once he's done, it's simply a matter of watering him in. There we go. And he's ready to go have a good life. 